We gotta do the King of Chinatown again. No, not yet. Welcome back to Hitman Absolution. Uh, Saga is very upset that he missed a bunch of stuff, but well, like all of the stuff, it's I could have gotten an axe fine. and a brick and evidence and a fillet knife. Try that again. You heard what I said. What what, what was it? F- fillet fillet. There you go. <laughs> oh, good, more plot. Waiting for what? For what? The, oh, the, so the jury to deliberate. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, look how old that phone was! I didn't see it. That's too busy laughing my own joke. It was like one of the it was like one of the old Sony phones with the the dial thing oh, on the shit. front. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and the call and hang up button. <laughs> Oh man. God, what were we as a civilization thinking with the buttons on the front? Of this <laughs> I'm so glad we moved past that. Yeah, yeah me too. Oh, ow. To keep you safe. That looked painful. Was it, did they kill the nuns? No, I'm pretty sure he just cut out his tattoo with a straight oh, razor. Oh, shit. Yeah, look at that. Oh, man. I'm pretty sure I had that phone. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It'll be sweet. sweet. I love that guy. <laughs> Terminus. I hear they need a good public defender. <laughs> Bring your power to I asked my bird the question, Holmes, and the answer came back oh, in the yes. shape of a name. Blake Dexter. Wow, that's an unfortunate an name. <laughs> like, you're to no, he's, oh, you're totally right. He, oh, he, and man. he just put a band-aid on. Because he's a badass. Have you seen Law and Order? <laughs> Still, nothing has got me from prosecuting. <laughs> we we don't have sunglasses. We don't have sunglasses. Yeah, it's, we're Law and Order, not CSI Miami. Right. Oh, Hotel Terminator is deteriorated. Late night decision by the look of it should provide several entry points. You did it. It's a hotel. Getting in cannot be that hard. Grappling hook. Oh, snap. I want to do the grappling hook it way. How do I do that? I don't know. Probably go find a vantage point. And... Oh, look. I don't have my pistols anymore. I just got this little snub nose. Yeah. Like well, I mean, you, you don't work for the agency anymore. So, you know, budget cuts. <laughs> <laughs> that was rude. Some dude just parked there, and you were like, <laughs> just hey, car. Got it. You're trespassing. Uh -oh. You're trespassing, and he's legit. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. Okay. okay. God, look how many points I lost. Hey. <coughs> look at that electrician conveniently standing there in an outfit that you could take. Or not. Hey, look, a wrench. How am I going to take his outfit when he's talking to that guy? I don't know, but you just, there was a wrench right there. Maybe he has another one in his truck. He's probably going to come back out to his truck at some point. Dick? I don't know. Do they ever bring everything they need in the first time? No. They get paid by the hour. Exactly. Well, I don't want to just, like, camp this dude's truck. Why, why not? Because I lost 1,200 points. Oh, that guy's gone. Oh, good. No big deal. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm just, don't mind me, I'm just hiding in a dumpster. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Can you use your instinct in there? I'm pretty sure you can. Oh, yeah, you totally can. I, I can't turn the, the other guy I behind can't, you. I can't, I can't turn Oh, well. Well. I guess that makes Ooh. sense. It's kind of a... But I can see him on my little radar. He's not looking. Oh, wait, this. I don't know why I go X Men when I when I'm like doing <laughs> sneaky music. Like that theme fits right in there with like uh, the James Bond theme in Mission Impossible in my say, head. Mission I don't know Impossible why. Is the one I go with. We have but like I'm always thinking something like that, and then I just apparently go with the X Men animated series theme for some reason. It doesn't make a lot of sense, but that's. Fine. Well, there's a guy out there. Shit. Oh, it's just another bitch. I have one of those. Ooh. Oh, that was. That's a great way to sabotage something. Just gonna hang out in here. 
you know. Why you guys do all your flashlighty shit? Uh, uh. Oh, comes that electrician. Oh man, get! <laughs> I just fit. want you to like tap him on the shoulder, and when he turns around, <laughs> just knock him out in one punch. All right, so we're gonna disguise in the electrician stuff. And then just toss him in. Oh, just put him in the did you kill him or did you just uh I, oh no I killed him. Oh man. Like he was just doing his job. I mean granted he was a shitty electrician, but like I don't think you should get killed for that. I have so many no I have like no points. Well yeah, you have a negative four thousand three hundred like, It's all because I wasn't paying attention. Well, maybe do that. Go straight to the top. Go straight to the top. Oh guys. Well, the electrician work down here is good. We gotta go upstairs now. Yeah, I gotta go check, uh... Hey, there you go! I'm gonna go, uh... I'm just gonna make sure... That, you know, the upstairs didn't... Pool on power. the roof is... Heated. I, I, I don't know anything about the law. Or order. I'm just an electrician. Yeah, have you noticed how I'm not wearing a tie? <laughs> <laughs> I've, every lawyer I've seen always has a tie. Typically a red one. Power tie. It makes you feel, you know... This guy, he's like... Oh, fuck. <laughs> God I didn't damn. even hold the fucking elevator. <laughs> Not even that, but the lights yeah. are down down here. Where's he going? I think the, I think the problem's further up. You sure are a son of a bitch. Oh, that was much better than what they said to me the first time. She's like, that was a little messy. You just shot everybody. Well, in their defense. I was having an off day. Yeah. I mean, in their defense, I just shot everybody. Well, yeah. But I take law and order very seriously. <laughs> <laughs> I like I the did. idea that 47 is just an enraged public defender who's lost faith in the legal system. So in his mind, he's just doing a public service. <laughs> oh, we're right. He's with built that up. He's built playground. up this entire play in his own head. Before he assassinates his target, he's just guilty. <laughs> <laughs> God, he just always looks so angry. <laughs> to be fair, he did just cut, cut part of his head out, though. Well, yeah. Hey, uh, I'm the electrician. I'm just here to... That it was the same guy from downstairs! How did he beat me? Wow, he must have some serious cardio. No kidding. Dude, you want to lift, like, lift together? I mean, I'm an electrician. I don't yeah, need that to That was do. like nine stories. He must have been booking ass to What am I supposed to be doing? What's my goal? You have to kill a dude, guys. Yeah, but... Wait, How no. are you back at zero points? Oh, because you're in the upper, upper floors floor. now. What was the journal button? Oh. Well, okay, we're experiencing some technical difficulty, mostly because Saga can't remember what the buttons are. Maybe try escape. Yeah, that's the menu. Okay. I want the journal. Okay, so what about... Not control. You found it. Good job. Uh, okay, Birdies and Tales Never Wrong, Midwestern Arms Midwestern Manufacturer named Blake Dexter's in Chicago Search and Victoria. Oh, yeah, unfortunate name, guys. Oh, yeah, okay, so. Yeah, girl, okay, so. Da, da, da. Blake Dexter's suite is uh, only one floor up, and security is tightening the elevator. It's clearly not an option. Also, civilian witnesses increase the risk of a direct confrontation. Just locate an alternate route. Okay, so I just need to go up one more level. Cool. Stairs? Fire alarm, noise distraction. I want to I wanna do that. Well, the stairs are right. Yeah, I mean, I do. Because the stairs are being blocked. By I'm, the uh, I'm an electrician. I need to. Uh, I need. I need to check a, the fire alarm. I'm, this, a, I'm a fireman on uh, the weekends, and I just figured while I'm here. Oh, no, oh, but just, I am so sorry. My bad. My bad. You're right. That's on me. That's the wrong room. Damn it! Lost points again. Well, I mean, you just tried to like straight up. Am I trespassing if I go that way? Probably. They don't look too happy. Just ask one of them for a light. <laughs> I get to the fire alarm. Oh wait, I get it. Yeah. Yep. Tell me, tell me what you're working with here. Okay, so I'm gonna go into here, and there was police tape on this door too, leading right to the fire alarm. Tell your place is a mess. Well, your disguise is what? Oh, can you take the maid's disguise? Who's sorry? How is the guards alert? I'll just hide in here. What? How, how did the guards get all alerty? Did you do I know. It? I didn't think it was physically possible either, but that's what the cops are saying. Well, fire alarm. We could, I wanted you to try and take the maid outfit. Excuse me. Excuse me. Come here. I'm not going to kill you. 
You're fine. You're, you're just gonna wake up with a really bad headache. This guy, this guy, damn it! That would have been hilarious. I lost points for nothing. Well, but it totally would have been worth it. Uh oh. Yeah, he's. Well, we're going loud. Hold on, let me just get the civilian out of the way. I got six bullets. That's how revolvers work. Oh, man. Nice! Just melted that guy. Just melted that guy. He's scared. Oh, and check out your new duds! Oh, <laughs> this one's cool. Oh. oh, well, we tried. All right, back to square one. We're going to try that again. But... Shh. But better this time. Yeah. Yeah. His Get keyboard, the hell out of my house. This keyboard didn't come with one of those. No, I, t I just hit all the buttons looking for journal. It wasn't there. Okay. Are the stairwells secure? Uh huh. Let's try going this way. Nobody that way. What a good idea. That way to <laughs> didn't really pan out. No. <laughs> <laughs> I was really hoping you could take one of the Ooh. maid outfits. That would have been hilarious. Do not disturb. It indicates a fire nearby fire escape. What does? Oh, that guy. Okay. So we're gonna sneaky sneak. Because this is probably no good. Oh, sabotage the speakers. Bet you that'll be loud as shit. Just doing some electrician work. No biggie. Oh, can't get out. Can I there's, there's bars. I found a vent. Cool. What's, uh, what's out there? Oh, boxes. That's a good sign. Ooh, I'm in a hostile area. But. And somebody's really into shoes. Can you just bean someone with a radio? Okay, I watch this. Whoop. <laughs> and that window's open. Oh yeah, definitely go that way. That guy is super into shoes, and I'm not entirely sure why. And we're gonna just move past window. And we're gonna go to this fire escape. Or not. Oh, man. Well, what's the other way? Can you go the other way? No, wrong button. Just <laughs> get my workout. You gotta <laughs> keep blowing away. I gotta keep doing the rips here. The fire escapes the other way. There are more than one. Hey, look, another window. Well, maybe not that one. Oh, that's what's his dude. That's what's his dude? He got all pissed at you for trying to go in his room. Oh, well, that's fair. I would be pissed me too. Okay, so it's not this way. I gotta get to that fire escape. And then I can go up one floor. Uh huh. And then I'm where I need to be. Uh huh. How do I get to the fire escape, though? Um. <clears throat> can you go down a floor? No. Why, why not? Because. I can't. The elevator took me to here. Just subdue that guy. I think he's got to come. Look at how many shoes he's got. He's clearly running some sort of shady second-hand shoe business out of oh, his hotel. Oh, we can't have that. Right. How dare you offer reasonable prices on law and order? Come here. This is what happens. You break the law, I toss you in a crate. <laughs> um. Oh, you got him in there. Now this room's just clear. Look at, In the closet look at, you go. All right, well, this is where we are going to pick up next time. So that'll do it for episode two. Thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time. I want to go out the door. I want to figure out how to the fire escape.